Hi, my name is Nana Kadnani and I am from Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. And I am here on a band trip to Cuba to learn about Cuban culture and to play music and explore and learn. So one of the biggest highlights that um, I enjoyed the most was performing at the Jazz Cafe. That was lots of fun. We got to perform for a group of people who weren't a school group and who had just come to the Jazz Cafe to listen to music and lots of them really enjoyed the music we played for them. It's a completely different performing experience from performing for a school or performing. Another one of my highlights is also playing for the schools because school concerts in Cuba are a lot more fun. People get up and dance, they sing along. In Ottawa, it's a lot more formal. There's not a lot of smiling. And then in my last, one of the last favorite things I did was uh, the salsa, learning to do the salsa and the different types of dancing with all the different Cuban people who taught us all the different new things about Cuban culture. So as a musician, it has helped me improve a lot because before, the music in Canada that we play, it's all to impress adjudicators and it's all judged and ranked. Whereas here, the music is more fun, you have fun with the music, and I think that's an important lesson I'm taking back is that the only point of music is to enjoy it. So it doesn't matter the, how good you play or how technically perfect the music is, it's how much fun your audience has listening to it. All right, hi, my name is Kyle Nurse. I'm from Ottawa, Ontario, Canada, and I'm representing Colonel Bai Secondary School as one of the music teachers on this trip. We're here in Cuba in a cultural exchange, playing music and um, being a part of the community. So the reason we uh, came to Cuba with the Canada Cuba Company uh, was to offer the students a different opportunity to travel, um, and to perform while we're traveling. It gives them a great opportunity to um, <clears throat> perform for other audiences instead of just our own community and to hear many, many different uh, styles of music outside of our uh, usual uh, styles. Uh, the highlights as on this trip as an ed educator um, for me were when we went to one of the schools and we performed for the other students and the energy that they gave us was incredible and we were able to play even better and even louder and the, the groups was singing with us and it was so much fun and then we got to experience their energy through performance and they, uh, they got us up and dancing. The other uh, highlight kind of a sappy highlight was when we went to the community center and they performed for us and they got us up and they were dancing dancing with us showing us how to dance and all the uh, all the smiles on all my students faces were was really uh, bittersweet it was wonderful my name is Caitlin I'm from Ottawa Ontario Canada I'm here on the uh, Cuba trip for the Colonel by band and it has so far been a wonderful experience. This trip has really helped me uh, improve as a musician by seeing how uh, other people play their music. Now, the Jazz Cafe, you could really see how people just like jumped right into the music and they like felt it in their whole body. You could just really like feel it. It was amazing. Hi, my name is Angela Chen. I'm from Ottawa, Ontario, the capital city of Canada. And I'm here on a, our school's annual band trip. And we decided to come to Cuba this year. Um, I think we got to listen to a lot of different kinds of music. In Canada, we just kind of listen to a lot of like pop and like not ne we don't necessarily get to experience a lot of like live jazz music. For example, during this trip we got to go to the jazz cafe and at the jazz cafe we got to listen to like uh, world-renowned musicians do like improv jazz which is really interesting and really cool and really helped me like think of what I should be doing with my life as a musician. So the students that came on this trip uh, have a better idea of the Cuban style of music 
and they're able to explain it in many different ways, including a horse historical context, and um, they can apply it to pieces where we're, we have lots of Latin rhythms involved, jazz rhythms, and uh, apply everything to the uh, to the music that they perform. A lot of the groups use an extended amount of musicality and phrasing that uh, we're not as advanced at yet, and they can see that through um, their peers and people of their, their own age. So it was a really good experience to, um, to have the kids listen and absorb uh, lots of great music from this community. My name is Jeremy. I'm from Ottawa in Canada. We're here for our annual Cuba band trip. Just seeing all the native Cuban players playing, it was just so amazing. I could tell how much effort and time, sweat and tears they put into their music, and it was honestly so inspiring to listen to their music. This experience was definitely an enlightening time in my life. Just experiencing the Cuban culture and Having just a different worldview, a different perspective, provides so much insight in how the global community works. I definitely recommend this for everyone. It's just a great time and a great, great experience to be part of. I would definitely recommend the trip because you learn a lot on the trip and you learn a lot of new things you just can't learn in Ottawa and back home in Canada. I. The, some of the souvenirs I'm bringing back are a clave and guiro, and I want to play the Cuban music I've learned for everybody and then tell them to come on the trip and tell them to go see Cuba for themselves. So to my colleagues that are thinking about uh, coming on a trip like this to Cuba, uh, cultural exchange and performing, I think it's a wonderful opportunity for your students and for yourself, um, <clears throat> for them to uh, experience different styles of music, to um, feel what it's like to, to go on tour with your band, uh, all the uh, responsibilities that need to be taken care of to um, make this trip a success. And it's a completely different experience from our usual trips um, around our own country or just south of the border. We get to go a little bit farther and experience so many different styles of music and, uh, and experience a, a tour, which is great.